So from a musical standpoint, you 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 come from a different era. Yes. And you see what's happening out here now. And people can, yeah, a lot of people shake their heads when you start talking about the musicality and et cetera, et cetera. From little Yachty talking about Biggie to your thoughts, bro. You, you're 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 a you're a, I mean, a benchmark of that era. Please, your I mean, thoughts. you know, you know, I, my thoughts on that is just like ninety nine point nine percent of the people thoughts on that. Life after death alone, you know what I'm saying, should get the respect of any of these young dudes. You know what I'm saying? If these young dudes don't know shit, which most of them don't know shit. And pick a, Google, motherfucker. You ever heard of Google? Google, little nigga. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that sold 40 million records on one album? I believe the word was overrated. Overrated? His hair color is overrated. <laughs> you know what I mean? Sell, sell some records. Pay homage to the cats that made it possible for you to be here. Mm-hmm. And if they was here, you wouldn't even be here. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I don't blame him for not knowing, you know what I'm saying? Because most of the Generation X don't really know. Shout out to you millennials. Do your research. If y'all want to get in the music business or any business, just Google. Uh, I don't got there. How you know uh, the uh, Google? That's all. You know what I'm saying? Pay homage to those before you. You know what I'm saying? It's called respect. What do you think the need to, to be disrespectful in the first place comes from? Why why that, would that even be something that needs to happen? Because, you know, obviously somebody around him and, and somebody that's in his camp or whatever must have said something for, to even let him get that thought. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, God bless these youngins, man. You know what I'm saying? Because little what's the name sound like young um, such and such. All them dudes sound the same. You know what I mean? I don't remember... What I what I have to tell the kids that I talk to is, I mean, there was a little bit of friction, but nobody had to sit down for the legends I remember to stand up. Absolutely. Biggie didn't didn't beef with Rakim and tell right. him to go away. Right, right. Pac never said, Chuck D, get out the paint so I can do my thing. And none and, of them dudes disrespected each other like, yo, he's overrated. Uh, what? Them, these We're talking about legendary hip-hop icons. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And these, this dude been in the game, what, one second? You know what I'm saying? Comparatively, so. here today, gone tomorrow. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, man, these dudes—they don't have no clue. But what I will say is, shout out to Uncle Murder. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. Who do you like? Who, who I like who Uncle does Stevie Murder. Check for it. I like Uncle Murder, man. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I like Uncle Murder. That's Think about I, that, putting something together, y'all. Yeah, I mean, you know, we get that going. Yeah, yeah absolutely. I'll call him today if absolutely. you ain't already got it. Yeah, like, yeah. I'm saying my thing is like we was working together before. He, this was like about before I even got on Love and Hip Hop. I was vibing with him in the studio. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, it's just like, you know, I respect what he's what he talking about. Mm-hmm. Main though, I respect what them dudes talking about. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? It's like, and I can understand what they saying. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I and I could respect what they saying, Dave East. I respect what you're doing. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, Kendrick Lamar. I, I respect what he's doing. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah. You know where, what I'm saying? Where, did the, where do you think, as an observer and somebody who's been in this for so long and through one of the best, where do you think the drop-off came? Where, when did it happen exactly where hating became so you know, you can't say anything, otherwise you're hating on it and... Well, you know, I just think and the, and the things and the, the we just went off the rails somewhere as far as the standards were concerned. Where yeah, did know, that happen as far I as I just you're believe concerned? that's when, you know, all of these execs was like, yo, we need somebody to sound just like that. Get get one of them. Mm-hmm. Give me one of them um one of them um dudes like that. One of the mushmouth dudes like that. Get one. That's the way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, get get one of them. That's the way. But that's not the way. You know what I'm saying? Are we progressing or are we regressing? Are we digressing, are we you know what I'm saying? I can't understand where, you know, or why the executive want, wants something like that. Is that where, you know, are we growing? Is that better than the Pox and the Bigs and the Nazis? Right. Are we progressing? And, and, and the Rock Kims and, and, and the Raekwons? I'm trying to understand. Are the gurus, what, what are we doing?